Cuando compites contra los mejores, tienes que subir el nivel. Por este motivo hemos invertido 100 millones de dólares en nuestras fábricas. Hemos contratado a los mejores para examinar cualquier variable posible y conseguir que la Chrome Tour sea más larga, veloz y más consistente que la Pro V1. Pero el objetivo no fue simplemente competir, sino ganar. Y ya estamos preparados. Pruébala y entenderás por qué Chrome Tour es el nuevo oro en rendimiento. You know, really excited about uh, being in the ceremony later today. <laughs> you really burst onto the scene last summer at the USAM, and then you were low am at the Masters, and you did this this week. What's that run been like these past 10 months? Uh, it's been it's been wild. You know, it's something that um, you know maybe three four years ago I didn't think was possible, um, and uh, to accomplish all this has just been uh, phenomenal and. Uh, You know, just the stuff of dreams, really, as an amateur to do everything I've done. I think I've checked all the boxes now. How cool was it playing with Luke down the stretch there? You guys were battling and in the same group. It was really fun to watch. It, it was awesome. Yeah, he, he played great today. Um, you, know, he, you know, he really, really made it tough on me. And um, he's got a lot of good golf left. And you're going to be seeing him out here again very soon. I mean, he's such a quality player. And um, if any of you guys are following college golf, you know, he's one of the best out there. So. No doubt he'll be back and uh, ready to go again. Open up for questions to the left. Neil, what does it mean to be one of six to do what you've done, and what does it say that you've done that? <laughs> I think it means I got some big shoes to fill because the guys who've done it before have obviously gone on to have some great careers. Um, you know, but for me, it's just uh, you know I think it just really solidifies my amateur career uh, as I turn pro next week, and I'm just really happy with you know, the career I've had as an amateur and the legacy that hopefully I, I'm, I'll leave. Brantley? Neil, can you speak to the differences between the Masters when you kind of have things wrapped up and then this one when it was pretty much a 1v1 match play uh, scenario out there? Yeah, I mean, Masters weekend was really all about soaking it all in and having a lot of fun. Um, and, you know, that weekend getting to play with Cantley and Tiger and All that was just a cool, really cool experience. Um, I think this week, having to play well on the weekend to earn low AM honors really kept me focused. And uh, I think that shows with my play and finish. You know, I, I think I finished really, you know, finished really well. I don't know what I'm going to end up at, but, um, you know, it's, uh, you know, for my first US Open, really happy with my play. Um, could you kind of go through your travel schedule and what's next? I know you're going to play PGA Tour Americas this coming week. Yeah, well, I think we had to roll back to Nationals. I was over on the West Coast um, now two weeks ago, came back to Columbus, back out to the West Coast for Q School. I went to Dallas for a wedding and then straight here. And now I'm going back out to Victoria on the West Coast. So we're kind of going around the country and a lot of long flights, but um, lucky that I'm young and can handle all that still. <laughs> over to your left, Jonathan. Has you played Luke or match play at any time? Uh, I don't think I've played match play with Luke. I've played with him on a few occasions in college golf. Um, and so I, I've, we've known each other for quite a while, and I know what a quality player he is. Neil, did you think about um, being low am when you were out there playing? I mean, you were head to head with him? I, absolutely. It's definitely on our mind. You know, we wanted to win and we wanted to, you know, get that, you know, especially, you know, there's nothing else to really win out here with where the leaders are at. So um, that's definitely on our mind. Yeah, a couple more questions over here on the right. One sec. I have a couple quick ones, but uh, oh. what do you know about Canada? Like, do you know much about it? <laughs> um, I went out there last year for the Pacific Coast Amateur. Um, we were in Vancouver. Uh, the people there are very nice. Um, that stereotype is true. Um, all the golf courses are, you know, tree lined and you know, old style. So uh, it's a little bit different type of golf than we see in the states, but. Really excited for that opportunity, and you know, the, from what I've heard out there, there's a real fraternity of guys out there, and they stick together really well on the PGA Tour Americas, and uh, really excited to join them here soon. And you know, a lot of great players out there um, that are already there, and a lot of great players coming from the PGA Tour U rankings. So um, it's going to be really competitive, and I'm very excited. I think it's going to help my game a lot to, you know, play against a lot of those guys. And then when you think back five years ago to a kid, senior in high school, limited Division I offers, uh, you know, far from a moment like this, 
what comes to mind? Like, what do you think about when you look at how far you've come? Uh, yeah, it's, I, I really just think about all the work I've put in throughout the whole, all five years. I mean, it's, it's been a long ride and a lot of hours, a lot of work with my swing coach, Way, and, you know, the coaches at Ohio State Dam, James Madison. And, you know, I've had a lot of people really believe in me uh, from the golf side of things. And also my parents as well put a lot of resources and belief in me and my ability to get my game to the highest level. And um, just uh, really happy to have such a great crew around me. Um, they, they're just awesome and have been a great support system for me. How do you um, compare and contrast the vibe of PGA Tour America's Q School versus Sunday at the U.S. <laughs> um, well, I mean, the the pressure situation down the end, It's there's a lot of pressure there. I was in a 9-for-1 playoff and got my card in that, and uh, that was some of those nervous I've been on a golf course coming down the stretch because it's you're playing to have a place to play for a whole summer, um, and that's, uh, that's really nerve-wracking. Uh, you know, coming down here, um, Part of it's just enjoying the experience, really. I mean, it's um, the uh, the experience of playing a major is just unlike anything else. And so, you know, obviously you're battling Luke and really focus on that. But you know, taking some time to soak it in and enjoy the crowds as well. And then the um, penalty you called on yourself yesterday had that. Like, what's the vantage going through your mind at that point? Um, you know, it was is one of those things that's really unfortunate, um, and sometimes just happens. And uh, yeah, head was spinning a little bit in that moment, but I think we did a really good job just uh, settling things really quickly. You know, um, we were in a tough spot to begin with. You know, leaving it short of that green and just kind of got it back to a position where we could then, you know, two putt from there from off the green, um, and then you know, going in the next hole, hit some good golf shots coming in. So. Uh, you know, I think with that blunder, we played really well yesterday. Uh, and, um, yeah, I mean, it's a, type, it's a type of stuff you just have to deal with and learn to deal with when you're playing a lot of tournament golf. What are you most looking forward to about being a, a professional golfer? Um, probably cashing a check. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to miss out on this week, but uh, I, obviously I wouldn't trade that for the experience I got this week, but uh, it'll hurt a little. <laughs> Well, congratulations, Neil. We'll see you later on the 18th green. Thank you. Hay un nuevo líder en rendimiento en el segmento de bolas tour. Chrome Tour es más rápida, más consistente, más larga que la Pro B1. Pruébala tú mismo. Entenderás por qué Chrome Tour es el nuevo oro en rendimiento.